a PM player bar too much these days, but everybody know Frozen. That's how it goes. Yeah. Might not be as active in the game anymore, but he's yeah. definitely a legend. The scale of one of the actors, my man has been doing jumping jacks in his room. Definitely seems to be very still uh, practice beating out Fearless earlier. We just saw him take out Dingo, so. Now Dingo on his way here. Trying to look up his run to get to where he was. Oh, lost the Thunders. And then after that, beat JJK. And then lost to Fearless. All right. Uh, we'd have to see how he did in pools then. That's what he did, yeah. That's where he got that cloud where it's one of beating uh, JJK. Yep. Number two player rank in Ontario right behind Blitz. Man got 13th at Smash and Slash. Hey, Definitely nothing to sleep on. Good stuff. However, it's a different Frozen. If that's Frozen, it's up against the world's number one project and player. It's up the drain. Safe for work done the drain. He's yep. in the building right now. Not safe for work done the drain. You can catch him at the tournament if he would have came here up to Smash and Delphia. Frozen, who also did work in the Wii U bracket, I think. Just barely made it, missed the big top eight, came out at nine. Yeah. That has that Mensa tag, trying to show that he's got a big brain. That's a quick 35. That gets grabbed, and Thunder's known for his incredible game off of that grab. He's about to hop up through that platform, throwing that nair out, making sure he connect with it. So that uh, Frozen cut punish him in respect. This isn't the first time, even in recent memory, that we've seen a Mewtwo in top eight at a big tournament. Uh, with Fuzz doing so well earlier, as we alluded to. Now, Fuzz did have to play Thunders on the way there. Uh, Thunders took that game, uh, took that set. You can see if we can do the same thing to what some people say is the best Mewtwo in the business. Back here, not quite connecting it. Thunder's wanted. Thunder right there. Thunder is so percent. Thunder's is going to find a kill on you sooner or later. It's only a matter of time. However, you do not want to get grabbed again so early in the stock. Drop a punish, not connected with that Nair. However, now it's 53% and the combo is still going. Nair, hover, Nair out of shield. Trying to go for that. That long tail outranging DK. He's trying to make sure that he's off stage. Use the reverse hitbox with swings a little bit too early. Yeah, that's a tag to the fair. Recognizing he was going in that direction. Wanted to give him something to pack with him for his travels. For Jordan there. That's just a lot of people cross canceling, but uh, Frozen was able to just get immediately out of that with that life save there. Thunder has just been playing so incredibly around Mewtwo's hitboxes. Mewtwo with his, his hover ability, his crazy nair, everything else. He's mixed up from Frozen, not landing where this man thinks he is going to land. Keeping something in the bag. Not showing all of his tricks. Gets the last oh. right there. <laughs> Goes for the edge guard. Oh. Can't be the happiest. Oh. And that's what I'm saying. Thunder's is playing so well around the crazy hitboxes that Mewtwo's able to throw out. He's just spacing like it's another day in the park. Going for a walk right now with GK. Not going for a go. walk off the edge of the stage. The edge guard situation from the first bear to the second one. Exactly what you want to do with that flow. Allow yourself to put out a hitbox in your opponent's path. Yeah, and on that, usually you want to DI out. You know it's unintuitive. You don't want to be further off stage, but if you don't, he's going to hit you with that second one right away. In fact, I've seen both Fuzz and Frozen get many three, four hit back airs. Very reminiscent of a Jigglypuff Wall of Fame. They go, brings them through that platform, side B. Crazy floaty is able to get out a lot of DK's usually guaranteed combos. Oh, F smash active free, not enough. It does stay a little bit long, but Thunder's yep. with the correct spot dies in that situation. 
incredibly disjointed, very long, but doesn't matter if it's oh, yeah, from a mile away. The float. Looked like he was trying to do a flow aerial in the opposite direction, and somehow ended up landing on the platform right there. Throwing out a smash that wasn't even aimed at where Dungeons was going to be. Tell uh, just a little tech club there is can be due to Frozen not being as affluent in Project M as he has been in the past. For someone who's been spending a lot more time in Wii U, this man has put on a run on the way here. Actually, he's better in PM. Uh, got ninth in Wii U, so sitting pretty in Winter Summons. Very, very pretty. That's what you like to do. Trying to figure out, I can't see from here who Frozen is right where he right wants now. to go. Uh, Frozen got out of a lot of the throw combos, at least at earlier percents. That Thunders was uh, doling out got a lot out of uh, the, the follow-up mares from F throw and up throw that you can see Thunders through a lot of the time. It catch people crouch canceling the follow-up. Yeah, that's right. So I want hopefully he makes use of that in that stage. Three, allows him to juggle two, a little bit better. One, go. Patient as possible, but that down tilt not far enough to avoid DK's incredibly far range. Frozen super smart, opting not to go. Okay, okay, he's still alive. Oh that was God. a little ridiculous, but he's still alive. No, he's not. No, I had to drop my headset real quick, fam. No, he's not. I ain't gonna break y'all ears. That is smash or something else. Frozen back in the game. Getting that flow in there. Finally finds uh, Thunders at enough percent that he cannot get a cross cancel off on that down tilt. The second place right there. Not truly cross cancel. But finally finding some follow ups. Check that alliteration, fam. Holla at you. Ooh. Not enough SDI in those uh, up airs right there. Ooh, catches him. Situation. Not really able to send him any further. It really seems like he's struggling to put any solid hits together. Just in front of that ledge, unsafe. What? You cannot be there. Even if you decide that you want to throw out the move, that punch will take priority. Through ridiculous donkey it. punch from ledge. Great. Uh, <laughs> oh, jeez. Gets straight on the stage and throws out that disable, but the hitbox on Spinny Cone. That is a trade for Thunders. We'll make every all day, day, every day. Every day. Week, fam. Down to second one is the fair connected. But here we see that Thunders was going for that Nair after he follow up at lower percents, and he saw that Frozen was getting out of him. And now he's uh, switched his combo game up to include that Nair a little bit better. Puts him so close to the stage, and a great DI from Frozen to get behind him on that floor throw, uh, cargo throw, but still Thunders not putting out a little bit of a guess, figuring out where. Frozen's going to teleport to you. This is wrong, and now he's taking a lot of percent for it. He got stuck on that top of that platform. Wow, and two three shots in a row. Frozen, they're, they're exchanging neutral uh, pretty evenly. It's not too heavily one side of the favorites, but every time Thunders finds a grab on Frozen. He's taking such immense damage that every time Frozen is just climbing himself back in. Three, two, Hopefully one, he can stay on go. top of Thunders this game and keep that lead throughout. I do like this counter pick. Uh, I know he lost here earlier, but this is a good stage for me too. Uh, in fact, he has, as I'm Ooh. saying that, Thunders! Um, good stage for me too. Uh, he can do auto cancel teleports to every single one of those platforms. Uh, from the platforms themselves. Great, that was an uh, awesome angle right there. There are a lot of different angles of that teleport that you were able to make use of to find yourself in different distances when you operate out of. He was able to turn around, closing the, throwing out one of the, the smaller ones right there, and lower ones angled to the ground, so he was able to follow up on that platform. But under Good call. Yep, and Good now call. that is another 50% off of one neutral He's stage. about four 60. moves in. Half the stock is gone. They go for that down tilt, but that... That down air doesn't hit and gets hit by spinning donkey. Wow, and that was off the top! 
Thunder happens. He has a high difference. away with this right it's, now. It's a little bit different when you're getting met with a move that's going to kill off the top and you're accounting for the stage platform versus when you're on a battlefield platform and it's higher to that blast zone. Not a good look for this man right now. Down there, hits the shield and decides to forward smash, covering that jump out. As good as down tilt is, Frozen actually isn't finding that much off of it. He has, like, it seems to have better openers uh, off of grabs. Goes in the jab to the nair. Listen up, not the oh, right. and that donkey punch loaded up, ready to go. Salvaging the rest of that stock, trying to get him further. Frozen just really seems to be struggling to string too many hits together. It's another 7%, and like I said, not really getting a whole lot off of this it. This is good. Thunders has been trying to get in uh, twice successfully with a reverse aerial rush move, and Frozen has been putting out hitboxes in front of him to, to interrupt it. He's got 76% off of it, so good. You know, shout out to him. Making some small adjustments. So hopefully, it quite to him taking this game. It's going to be a very uphill battle. Yep. He's been making adjustments, certainly, but it might be a little too late. And Fair should be able to take it if he cleans up. It's heavy enough that he may live. Maybe one or two attacks. It doesn't oh. get that as. Didn't want Thunders to land back on stage. Fair about four frames of end lag on DK's up here. It's, I don't know what the frame is, but it's ridiculous. Something around the area. It's, you can please correct like me if I'm wrong, but it's, it's, it's pretty good. I know there was that one point when... <gasps> the winner is... Thunders! Ow. Thunders! He didn't even need to do that. Like, that was so... You Thunders, even need to why do are you that. so extra? <laughs> the, the game, the set was over. You Finish. beat him already. You could have had, you could have three owed him with three stocks. Nah, let's be real. When you up and you snapping on oh, somebody, yeah. like I'm doing that too. <laughs> how but, how but dare you tell his eye? It could have been <laughs> a three O in each of them been a three stock. I mean, basically, right there, let's, let's just call it what it was. That was a JV3. Obviously ready for his spot in winner's finals, which he just earned. I think he's making it through Frozen right there. So yep. we will see who will be.